Watch, oh. watch your face. And out of that incredible rescue last night in Sefner, deputies saving a young boy from a home erupting in flames. ABC Action News reporter Sarah Hollenbeck heard from those brave rescuers today, and the sheriff says they never gave up. And what felt like a lifetime watching that body cam video happened in only three minutes. Who else is inside the house? There's a kid inside. Hillsborough County Deputy Alex Maldonado rushes towards a house erupting in flames. It's just before 11 Thursday night and the home on Joe Ebert Road is being gutted by fire. He and Deputy Kevin Reich beat firefighters to the scene. Where's he at in the house? Owen! Nine-year-old Owen is trapped inside his bedroom. His mom and her boyfriend were able to escape, but the flames too intense to reach Owen. Thick black smoke fills every corner of the room. Deputies Reich and Maldonado struggle to see. Can't see what's in there. They try to direct Owen towards their flashlights. Where you at, bud? Three minutes Where's later, Deputy here? Reich come feels here. Owen's Reach arm. Us. Keep coming. Come on, come here. Give me your hand. At this point, they're finally able to pull the nine-year-old to safety. Once we could see his arm and we could... Uh, Deputy Reich was able to reach in and, and pull him to the window and we could get him up over the window. Um, just relief and happiness. This is a moment Deputy Maldonado will never forget, and neither will neighbors who witnessed the harrowing rescue. Hero is a small word to say for what he did. The guy, is, he's, he's awesome. Owen is still at Tampa General Hospital being treated for smoke inhalation as well as burns, but the deputies tell us they are praying with all their might that that little boy is going to be okay. I have an opportunity to just you know, say hi to him, but um, biggest thing is just making sure that he is able to, you know, recover. A chance he now has because of deputies who didn't waste a second. Three minutes is all that stood in the way of this young child living or dying. And it's because of their actions that that three minutes hopefully will save this child's life today. In Sefner, Sarah Hollenbeck, ABC Action News. And just moments ago, we heard from the boy's parents who say they are eternally grateful to those heroes. I don't know. I, I, I'm just so grateful, you know, and the, and the reason I wanted to just, you know, encourage her and myself to speak to the media today because, you know, you know, heroes need to be recognized like these guys were heroes. <laughs> if it wasn't for them, my son would be dead. It was like within minutes he was going to be, he wouldn't have made it. And, and you know, and too, all too often we talk about the bad and I, and I feel like it's very important that we talk about our heroes and the, and the police are good and they, they, you know, they, they saved our son's life, and, and I'm, I'm so grateful. Right now, Owen is in the intensive care unit at Tampa General Hospital. He has smoke inhalation and burns on his face and right arm. We'll keep you updated on his condition. We are all thinking of that family right now.